Hello everyone and welcome back to the Red Lantern where we have just completed Finn's story. Look at her cute little hat. Uh, I Finn is definitely one of the dogs I knew the least about and I think she's become one of my favorites very quickly. Uh, but the dog that we're going to be following today is another one that you guys have said will probably be one of my favorites and that would be Noodle, the last dog that we have not yet adopted. So we're going to go ahead, jump on our sled, get back on the trail and adopt another dog. We've only got two stories left to complete with the final one being Stilton, but we're going to do his in the next episode. So for now, let's go out and see if we can find Noodle. Oh, hey, our next stop is here. I'll go see who they have for us. Oh, Noodle, what a cutie. Huh? <laughs> I can see that. I said running alone wasn't enough for you. You were looking for some kind of challenge and a musher who would listen to you, too. Well, I don't really know what I'm doing, so uh, having some help out there might be nice. You just need something to motivate you. Perhaps a new adventure? New family? Just know that I still have to make the calls and try to do what's best for us. Will that work for you? Oh, Noodle is so cute. Let's hop in the room. <laughs> I'll introduce you to Chomper. Well, welcome to the van. This is Chomper. He's a city pup, but he's ready to get out there and learn how to become a sled dog. It sounds like you weren't too big a fan of indecision last time you raced. And that I should trust you when I'm not sure what's best. Well, I'm more than willing to defer to you if your instincts are sharp. I trust that you're a smart pup, Noodle. And I need help with more than running. But you can't just lay down in the middle of the trail, okay? We've got a new life to start. And once we're home, I'll build you a nice little den with a perfect nap zone. How's that sound? <laughs> All right, you're right. Rest up. We've got plenty of running ahead of us. You ready to help us train? You're in charge. All right. So I uh, guess it's time to start, huh? Let's have Noodle go ahead and take the lead. I brought Bodega, Iggy, and Slayer along for this run. And oh, we've already got the Christmas lights. Now, a lot of you guys, and, and I mean a lot of you guys, this has been a recurring comment, have said that you thought I would really appreciate Noodle's story. Right. So I'm excited to get to see it finally. Huh. It looks like there's something out there. Okay, what oh. do we have here? We definitely needed some more bandages. That's a promising start that brings us up to three med packs, which is good. Thanks for waiting, pups. Slow down a bit, pups. What is that? I'm mm. pretty sure that's a porcupine. Oh no. We've had some trouble with these guys in do the you past. Guys poke yourselves? What if you get like a mini tumbleweed back there? No, oh, there probably aren't tumbleweeds here. I'm just making mm -hmm. an observation. I don't know what to do with you. It's not like Chomper can have at you. We already hunted a moose earlier. I didn't show it because it was pretty straightforward, but I don't think we need the food, so let's just keep moving. But seriously, what about like a leaf just getting stabbed on one of your spikes? Then what? Hi, <laughs> Noodle. This feeling more exciting to you? Yeah, okay. Let's just get some scratches in. Right. I'm just here to pet you. Noodle, are you trying to bring it closer or keep it away? How close do you think that wolf is? Oh. Oh. Okay, okay. Um. Oh boy, this is dangerous, but I think we gotta try to let it go. Ooh. Easy there, bud. I'm glad you brought us out. Whew. Here. I hope that wolf makes it. Oh, we got an event for that. Okay, I'm back. We found a skeleton in a trap Let's before, too, so... 
I'm leery of leaving anything we might find out here because it seems like there have been some traps abandoned. Is that a squirrel up there? Why is it running so... Oh, it's a weasel. Where did it go? I can only see a tree. Ah, there you are. You're not very good at hiding. My pups haven't learned to climb yet, so you're safe up there. Oh, the Slayer thinks she can reach owls. So maybe one day, far in the future, that'll be a problem for you. <laughs> oh. Hello? Hey there. Noodle, is that... Should we go over there? Oh boy. Let's go see. Oh. Did you kill this for us? Whoa. Uh, thank you. Oh. Well, and there he goes. Friend, Noodle. I'm uh, gonna collect some of this caribou. I'll see you at the sled. Oh. Wow, we got three food for that. Okay. Hey, okay. I guess the wolf was pretty thankful. Another meal ready to go. You were right, Noodle. We should still try to help the animals we can. It's hard enough out here. Nothing needs to suffer more. Thanks for making sure I remember that. Aww. Noodle's a good one. <laughs> I can't believe that wolf found us and got us some food. I'm glad I followed your lead, bud. That was a good choice. Oh, looks like we've found someone's dinner. Nothing for you to chase this time, Chomper. Bodega, might be time to grab a snack. Oh yeah, that's this right. Looks pretty fresh. We should be quick if we're gonna do anything. We'll let, we'll let Bodega get a snack. <laughs> That's you good? some trail food for him, I guess. But you know what? That's a good bit of energy. Well, actually it's only one bar. Some of these events I think are not affected by the booties, so we might want to just make sure that we're, um, that we're using the axe on that in the future. But it is fun to get the dog events. Don't get any bad ideas. You already have one, don't you? What in the... I'm really thankful you're not hunting me right now. Your self-defense mechanism Whoa. is more powerful than I thought. Whoa. Oh. Oh. oh, I can taste it. Might be our cue to go. Puke. Chomper, get me out of here. Give me uh, skunks have great defenses. That one won spikes. against the owl and managed to fend it Let's off. Seems being smelly does work out for you sometimes. That's why they why they have that. <laughs> oh whoa! Hello, friends. your friend is back. Oh, all right. <laughs> Hey, bud. I guess we've made a connection that makes me think this this definitely can be a dangerous thing in real life, but there it was one wolf, I think in Alaska, that was known for hanging out with and playing with, like, dogs in a local town, but we'll, we'll let him play a bit more. Ooh. Oh, that's cute. <laughs> Y'all done now? I hope you save some energy for the uh, trip. It seems like we're nearly there, huh? Say bye to your friend. Aww. Come on, Noodle. It's good to see Noodle's perked up a bit. You pups do okay? I think we're done here. Let's go. Aww, that is very sweet. But yeah, there was a wolf that was known for hanging out with dogs. Really? I I think that wolf has been following us ever since we helped it out. I'm sure I'll see it again someday. Aww. Closer. Probably will. I hope we're not acclimating him too much to humans, but... It seems like you made a friend. I wonder if we'll see them again. You're finding your true self out here. Aww. I wonder if the wolf will show up in, in subsequent runs then. Oh, we got Noodle's accessory! Yeesh, yeah, no kidding. Hmm. 
Oh, and we got six bullets. And we have Noodle's little sketch. Oh, that was a cute one. Yeah, it, I know I've said this like two or three times, but it definitely reminds me of that one story about the wolf in, Ala I think in Alaska, who used to hang out with dogs. Now you always okay. have to be so careful. <laughs> the the biologist in me is like, oh boy, you don't want to get the wolf too human acclimated because that could be dangerous for him in the future. But, you know, in it's a story in this case, he's not doing any harm. And to be fair, it's pretty remote. Uh, apart from getting stuck in that trap, there doesn't seem to be too many other human impacts out here. At least not, uh, not things that aren't abandoned. But let's go see what Noodle's accessory is here, because we haven't done that yet. Oh, wolf toy! Oh, that's so cute! Oh, that's precious. Oh my goodness. Oh, I love that. That that is that is absolutely adorable. The 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 accessories all have so much personality, and it's so cute. And I like how they correlate to the uh, different stories. But speaking of different stories, we've completed all but Stilton's, and so in the next episode, I thought we'd go ahead and let things end the way they began, complete Stilton's story, and bring our original team out on the trail. So next time we'll be uh, running with our original dogs again, finishing off Stilton's story, and wrapping up this series for the Red Lantern. Not to say we'll never play it again in the future, but I wanted to make sure we got through the main storylines because we didn't get to do this the last time I, uh, the last time I played. So yeah, and I've really been enjoying it. Like it's, this is definitely a great game. This is one I've had a lot of fun playing. That said, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode, but we are going to go ahead and leave things off here for today because it is getting to be about that time again. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you've enjoyed the episode. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. But until then, this is Jay, over and out.